you can, you can imagine that the very first minutes, the question was, uh, what happened? Uh, to the extent we know what happened, who did it? Can we prove that? How confident are we the scope and nature of what it was they undertook and under whose authority they took it? I, I may have missed a question in there, but there were a series <laughs> of questions uh, that immediately came. It came to the intelligence community. And in remarkable order, one of the most impressive things about the place that I work is we were able to develop several hypotheses around that and then to uh, begin to develop fact patterns which either supported or, or suggested that the hypothesis wasn't right. And we were, in relatively short order, able to deliver to our president a high confidence assessment that in fact it was a Syrian regime that had launched chemical strikes against its own people in Idlib. Uh, it took, uh, I don't say exactly how long, but we were good and fast. Yeah. Uh, not me, our team. Uh, and I don't mean just the CIA, the entire intelligence community was good and fast and we challenged ourselves. I can assure you we were challenged by the president and his team. We wanted to make sure that we had it right. And there's not much like when the president looks and says, Pompeo, are you sure? When you know that he's contemplating uh, an action based upon the analysis that your organization has provided. Uh, and we got it right. Uh, and I'm proud of the work that the team did to help the president have the opportunity to make a good decision about what he ought to do, again, in the face of this atrocity that took place.